I used to work in entertainment. It was super fun. In 2010, I went to the World Cup in South Africa. And I was there to cover stories about human interest, stories about the sport, and stories um, about travel and fun and extreme sports and that kind of thing. And everywhere I looked, everywhere I went, I would meet people with incredible personal stories. There were so many stories um, that needed to be told so that people could learn something and perhaps do something about what they think needs to be changed in the world. So I came back, stopped working in entertainment, and got into news. What has been important for me is to know that the difference between where I am and where I want to be as a journalist, it's research um, and it's hard work. You can tell the best stories by really knowing your subject. Sometimes when we have those gaps of knowledge because we didn't do enough research or we haven't met the right character or we don't know enough, that creates an insecurity and that insecurity can come across in the storytelling. And so I think before we venture out to start writing, we really have to know our stuff. I always go out with an open mind and an open heart and curiosity. Treat each story as it comes to you, digest it, live it, experience it. Yeah, sometimes I get depressed and sometimes I, I get very affected by the stories, but I think it's the only way to go about being truthful and authentic and connecting. It's about allowing for someone to have a platform to express whatever issue needs change or whatever story they want to tell. You can't follow anybody's path. You have to create your own. The fact that society hasn't allowed for enough women, especially women of color, to be re represented in certain areas doesn't mean that, there's, that the space is not there for them. You don't really need someone to invite you and say, hey, you can do it. You just try. And the worst thing that can happen is you fail. And then you keep trying. When you get there, make sure that you're opening the door and elevating someone as like yourself.